Welcome to FAR, the photographic series. In this series, we are going to guide you through cameras and photographers, their problems, their solutions and a lot more. Do keep watching. Welcome to another episode of FAR, the photographic series. In the last few episodes, we were speaking about how you can become a photographer, what can you do, what are the necessities for being a photographer and your, how can you be different from other people. Now, we are going to take you about being different, about marketing yourself as a photographer. That is another very important step in photography. In the last 50 years, photography has taken a very big step into the creative world. Photography is today used for a lot of things like advertisement and marketing and social media of a lot of companies. Till yesterday, you can say that there was nothing like product photography. It has recently in the last five years come into existence after the online market has started rolling. Today, if you see sites like Jabong, Mintra, Yepme, Flipkart, Snapdeal, Amazon, they are surviving on product photography. Basically, jo dikta hai, wahi bikta hai. This concept I had explained before also. So, today your product has to be seen much better than what it actually is. So, that is all about it. Or whether you be as a person, people don't like that natural look of this anymore. They do photography so that it can be retouched in post editing and they can look much better than what they actually are. Today, if you see portfolios of a lot of people, you will understand this that what they actually look and what after makeup and photography are they made, they made to be look is pretty different. So, that is the creative part of photography which you need to understand, and marketing it is very important. Today, we have got so many platforms to market it. We have Facebook, we have Instagram, we have LinkedIn, we have n number of platforms, we have YouTube for our videos. We have Facebook for our videos. So we have so many platforms. So why not market this? Because it is all about a visual world. People will have to see your work to understand what kind of work do you do. If you do not do that, how will people know that you are doing that great work? It is not like before that people were only recognized by names. Because at that point of time, there were only 10 photographers whom the people knew. Today, there are 10 lakh photographers who people know. And one post on Facebook can give you maybe 500 comments of photographers ready to work for you. So obviously, that is the kind of competition that you're going through in today's time, which makes it necessary for you to be very, very different from others. Now about marketing yourself, photography only works on word of mouth recommendations. It does not work like that if even if your work is good or it is very, very nice, you're reasonable also to other people, still it will not work. Why? Because somebody has not recommended you. Recommendation is very important. So only once you work for certain persons, do not form a negative impact with them. Do not have a fight with them. Do not have any kind of controversies with them. Try to deliver whatever you have done. Maybe they might not be right on their part that they might have not paid you enough or they might have not given you what was promised. But do not make them upset. Because those are your clients who are going to give you different clients. It is word of mouth referral. One client equivalent to 10 clients in the coming 3 years. That is a written figure and is a guarantee. So do not spoil relations with anybody. Marketing does not only mean showing your work. It also means having a very very good positive conversation with your clients and keeping up to that. In case you have any questions, any queries, anything that you want to ask us, please do mention it in the comment box below or you can contact us on info at bxstudio.in. If you like the content of this video, please make sure you like, share and subscribe. Hey friends, this is Abdali Roshan, your very own house friendly photographer. We are going to talk about a lot of camera techniques, problems faced by photographers and a lot more throughout this series. So do keep updated with the fire series.